This is about how you want it to look. Nice and thick. Ooh, that's going to be yummy. So this is how it will look when it's cooked. You have a nice, still uh, viscous, I guess the word is, consistency, but at the same time it's nice and thick. You can see those dark specks in there. That's a little bit of a overcooked strawberry, but it shouldn't do shouldn't be having any problems with it. The uh, bits of strawberry that are still left are okay. I took my immersion blender to this and, and blended it up a little bit. Uh, and then I have my strawberries over here. They're washed and pulled and ready to go. I may need more, but we'll see when I start assembling the pie. So this is my crust. It's just a Standard store-bought shortbread ready crust that I picked up. And here is the uh, first part of the filling. It's cream cheese with a splash of vanilla. I think I added a little more vanilla than I wanted, but that's okay. You only need about a teaspoon, teaspoon and a half. I added some uh, powdered sugar to it and then blended it with my mixer. Uh, and it should be a fairly fairly creamy creamy mixture and then you just plop that down into the pie crust and once you get it all in spread it out to where it's even and I'll see you in the next installment Alright, so here you see I've halved most of my strawberries. They are not very, very big, but some of them were bigger than others, so I went ahead and halved them. The uh, the sauce is going to be mixed in with the strawberries. And I'm sorry, this is a little difficult to do with one hand, but I will attempt to do it as best I can. So, just pour that right over. Try to get all of it. Ooh, yummy. This is going to be one good pie. So get it all in there and mix it all up. Ooh, doo, 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 doo. Yummy, yummy strawberry pie. <laughs> Don't mind me. So I still have a little more to get in there. And then we're going to be rocking and rolling with the next step of the pie, which is pouring this over the, uh, the cream cheese mixture, which is already in the crust. All right, got that done. And now we bring our, our crust over and this just slides gently into the crust. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Here, I'll back it up a little so you can see it better. Now the nice thing about these ready-made uh, pies is they have this little plastic top. 
that you can then invert over after you take the, the paper out. And when you put it in the fridge, it has a nice little cover. Okay, we still have some stuff in there to move over to our pie. Okay, I think we are done. Next, just refrigerate for about four hours or overnight, and then enjoy. I hope you enjoy.